Kardashian's ex Damon Thomas responds to 2018 ecstasy wedding comments. Thanks for watching the video, do subscribe Blast of America channel. Hey love welcome to my channel. I hope you are doing great and enjoying the video. Damon Thomas, Kim Kardashian's first husband, believes it was unfair for her to claim she was high when they eloped. Kim Kardashian's first husband believes she claimed she was high on ecstasy when she married him in 2000 was unfair and reckless. Kardashian, who married music producer Damon Thomas when she was 19 and he was 29, admitted to using the party drug during the couple's Las Vegas wedding in a 2018 episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. In a recent interview with Vlad TV, Thomas, 51, said of the claim, Yeah, I don't recall that at all. So I don't she's the one who does it. They are free to say whatever they choose. I believe it's wrong to make broad generalizations like that because we now have children, you know? I have a family. My child attends the same school as hers. Imagine what he'll be like when he has to cope with that at school, Thomas remarked. According to the music producer, the reality star, 41, should be more responsible with those words because there's a lot more to that issue and those things. He added, I could go inside that and blow up the spot, but I wouldn't. And I've been extremely careful not to discuss the nature of that marriage or what it meant to me. You may try to throw things under the rug because it happened in the past, but you don't stay married or be with someone for four to five years just because you got high off of ecstasy, you know what I mean, he continued. That just doesn't make any sense. There's a lot more to that issue and those things, Thomas, right, explains. Thomas claimed Kardashian wasn't talking to her mother, Kris Jenner, at the time of their elopement, but he finally put the decision up to young love. From January 2000 to February 2004, Thomas and Kardashian were married. He claimed they met in 1998 and she was the one who inquired about him. He told Vlad TV, it wasn't what people might say. She was the one who did it. Thomas added he's proud of Kardashian and glad of her family, despite his thoughts about the ecstasy accusation. He's seen and spoken to Chris a couple of times over the years, and they're nice he said. Kardashian accused Thomas of being domineering and possessive in the couple's divorce papers, which were obtained by the Daily Mail in 2010. She also claimed that he physically attacked her. Thomas allegedly rejected the charges to Untouch Weekly at the time, saying, it's just totally not true, according to the New York Daily News.